Hello ladies and gentlemen welcome to Triple N Media I am Nick Nickum and this is Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 we're going to go all the way from Houston to Sydney Australia and explore Sydney by night so I have pulled up uh, the map of uh, Sydney here something I want to show you and Sydney, this here is the Sydney Opera House so we're going to take off here this looks to be in the water here then we're going to go around the coastal line here and come back and visit Sydney Opera House from the skies let's begin okay Sydney there Tower, NIK20, ready for straight on departure in runway 16 left okay there you go ladies and gentlemen i'm ready for my clear for take off runway 16 left departing okay. straight down approach Okay gentlemen we are ready here first i want to pull up my nav focus on my nav map as you can see we're going to be taking off right by the waters we're going to see water on both sides and uh, i want to see just give you a glimpse of how we're going to be approaching this our sydney opera house is somewhere supposed to be here so we're going to come here go around on the east coast 1800 let's get this going and maximum throttle all right so maximum throttle there maximum throttle there so yeah up to 50 miles seven miles so let's take off a little bit Let's maintain steady altitude. We're up to thousand feet here. So let us see if we can get into control one. If I can get autopilot going here quickly, autopilot altitude. We just give fifteen hundred. Two thousand is fine. Up. I'm trying to rotate this. Okay, I need to 2000 vertical speed. I think it is 500. Okay. Now we are uh, fine. Now we're going to focus on where we want to go. So it's going south. So we're going to be using the GPS uh, here. So this is going south. I need to go north. So this is uh, we're going to be using a uh, HDG There's HDG. So now this is our mark north here. So it is going to make a turn and come towards north automatically. You'll see that, and uh, you can see this uh, beautiful. Oh, this is pretty cloudy here. So what I need to do is, uh, as you can see, it's going to go north, and we're just going to cruise along the coastal line. Well, now we can see the landscape on the left side as we expect, and we're still flying over the water now to the north, like 30 degrees, and it will take us to where we want to go, the Sydney Opera House to start with. And you can zoom in and look at all these uh, beautiful downtown buildings in Sydney, Australia. and uh, our first uh, stop will be to look at uh, the opera house okay there's the bridge and we can fly along the course of the bridge that means we go towards west yes a little bit towards the west all right So now we are flying towards the west and here is the Sydney Opera House it, it doesn't look like it's lighted here but you can see is the Sydney Opera House which is right uh, underneath the Cessna 172 let me zoom out a little bit so this is the Sydney Opera House and here is the city of uh, Sydney and we are just flying over the downtown Sydney 
looking at all, all these various points of interest. So that means it is somewhere very close here on the map. So that's how we can just uh, just take a plane, pick an airport in a major city, just dial in the departure and you can just enjoy the scenery. Now we are flying over these uh, little backwaters and what we'll do is we'll make a, a turn here 90 degrees and we'll make a turn here and just roam around the city. To do that we're going to west, we're going to go to, we are going west, so let's go towards south, I have to go the other way, always take a 90 degrees so, so you're going like, so going in a box pattern which is a navigational uh, pattern and as you can see we are coming around here and I don't have to do anything, I just can just sit and enjoy the beautiful scenery. So we're making a 90 degree turn here, we're going to be coming straight down and make another 90 degree turn so that uh, you get the glimpse of uh, Sydney, Australia. We can either zoom in like this and get a very close up view of the city or we can just totally zoom out and get a pretty broad view of the, and here are some of the fields. Somewhere along is the cricket uh, grounds. Last time I checked, don't have the exact. There, there are no more signs here, so it is coming this way. So uh, what I can do is uh, go another 90 degrees here. Let's go to what are we? Here? Let's go towards east. I don't know. It's, everything is reverse. Let's go towards east. And the beauty is the GPS will automatically do it. You don't have, and we are set at an altitude. Our speed is 133 miles, which is fine. And here is the King Ford Smith International Airport. That's uh, where we took off. Remember, this is the air. <laughs> this is the runway we took off, which is right in the waters. It's a concrete asphalt uh, runway right over the waters. So. I mean, we are quite far off from there, but it looks like it's pretty close, but this is where we are, as you can see. So we are going around, and uh, let's see if we can find... Okay, this... Uh, we covered the Sydney Opera House, which we talked about. Let's see if we can zoom. In. Destination. Let's see if we can zoom more, I guess. Yep. Here you can see all the beautiful buildings, streets. I'm surprised there's no traffic in these streets. But uh, this has a pretty good uh, graphic representation. When I was flying in Houston, it was all looking like uh, like digitized uh, images. And uh, let's see. So we have to get this side. And it's making a turn. Hopefully it will intersect uh, uh, Sydney Opera House. And you can see all these backwaters uh, here and a beautiful scenery of uh, Sydney downtown as we can see and Sydney Opera House is located right along the waterfront. You can zoom in some more here. But of course this is night, it is not lighted but you get an idea as to how to look from inside. Uh, let's see here. Here's the Sydney Opera House, uh, which is uh, a great way to explore various parts of the world, just uh, sitting at your computer using the mouse and a little joystick. Thank you so much for watching this presentation and uh, please, please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and uh, next time we will uh, visit uh, a different uh, place of historic interest. Talk to you later.